Uh, hi, I'm Caroline Frick and I own 1904 Cannabis Company in Ladysmith, BC. We opened our doors on July 30th of this year after about a year and a half of applications and waiting for all the approvals from the different levels of government to come through. It required a lot of patience. Um, yeah, I think Ladysmith took their time in, in deciding how to allow licensed cannabis retailers to come into town and they did a good job of it. Um, that took some time and was a bit of a process. Um, the provincial checks were very thorough and time consuming and required a lot of work and input on my part. So yeah, there were, there were a lot of hurdles, but mostly a lot of patience. How did COVID affect your yeah, decisions? Yeah, it absolutely did. Like we are in a very small space. Um, so we are sanitizing constantly. You know, we only really have the space to have two people in the store at a time. Um, so I think even still that's affecting us. You know, some people don't want to wait outside on the street to come in, um, which is understandable. But uh, yeah, we are limited in our space. But I think we're doing all right. We're a small store, it's a small community. So I don't think we need to be much bigger. We just need to be patient. I have two bud tenders working for me. They're both really, really wonderful people, really passionate about marijuana and everything it can do for you. Um, I personally am more, uh, I use cannabis more for the CBD, more of the medicinal properties. Um, so yeah, between me and my staff, we have a lot of knowledge and um, we see all kinds of people come in, uh, people who have never used cannabis ever before. Um, you know, they've heard that it does, will help them with this or with that and come in looking for some advice. So um, yeah, we see a lot of people like that. We see a lot of people who want to buy an ounce of weed and go home and smoke it. And we can help those people too. Uh, we have a lot of edibles. Um, we have some with just CBD, some with just THC, and some with a bit of both. Um, we have some like sparkling drinks, we have lots of teas, a lot of people like the teas with the CBD or, or a mix uh, to relax at the end of the day. Um, we have a lot of different chocolates, uh, gummies are really popular, we have some mints, and we have some uh, dissolvable THC powder, so you can actually mix it into your own favorite drink if you don't like what's on offer here. Um, all the edibles are capped at 10 milligrams in a package. That's the federal government's doing. So if you want something stronger, we also have oils. Um, those are or edible oils, um, and those come in larger, larger quantities. So. Um, if your tolerance requires more than 10 milligrams, you can mix your own. The reason I hired the bud tenders that I did is that we strive to be welcoming to people of all levels, all experience, all kind of, you know, interest and knowledge and whatever kind of issues they're dealing with or why they're turning to cannabis. Like, we don't have all the answers and we're certainly not doctors, but uh, we want people to feel comfortable to come in here and ask the questions and maybe we can help get them started and, and find out what works. Okay.